What is up guys? Welcome back to another Crypto Camel video. Hope you guys are doing fabulous today. We're going to be going over some insane bullish news for Hush Finance. An insane amount of influencers, models, actresses, athletes promoting Hoge and buying Hoge. So let's just jump right into it. If you guys are enjoying these quick videos, remember to smash up the like button. Hoge Finance is looking at 61.5k holders, which is excellent. The price has recovered quite drastically. Like I always say, welcome to the Hoge party, everyone. Welcome to the Hoj Club. Hoj. Hoj. So let's briefly go over the Hoj Barstool night that was at 7.30 p.m. Eastern earlier today. So this was a great fireside chat with a guest speaker, Tommy Smokes from Barstool Sports. If you guys aren't aware already, Tommy Smokes, he supports Hoj as well as Tom Lay joined. He also supports Hoj. He's also from Barstool Sports, but it doesn't stop there. Mike Kafka, an NFL former quarterback and a current NFL coach also joining the chat as well as a bunch of other people. I think there were a few hundred people in the chat at one point. So I highly recommend for you guys to participate in these because it's very unpredictable. You never know who's going to join and who else is going to come along in the chat. And I took some key notes from the event. So let's go over that real quick. Wasso was discussing a lot of great news. And Wasso said that our attorney has classified Hoj as a commodity and not a security, which is great. That's going to allow a lot of forward momentum and advancement, especially in spite of US regulation and legalities and things like that. It's very good for us to be not a security. He also said, by end of June, USA exchange with a fiat on and off ramp, allowing buying Hoj with USD. That's going to be happening, guys. We're just around the corner. And he said, we're in the final stages with one exchange and close to final stages with a couple, which is great, guys. I'm really excited for the exchange listings. Let's take a look at Mike Kafka. If you're not aware of who this guy is, he's joining these chats periodically. It's not his first time. So clearly this guy has an interest in Hoj and in cryptocurrency market in general. So Mike Kafka is an American football coach and former quarterback who is the quarterback's coach and passing game coordinator in the Kansas City Chiefs of the National Football League of the NFL, which is insane. Who does this guy know? Who is he going to network with? Who is he going to talk about with? regarding Hoj. Who knows? We'll have to wait and see. Time will only tell. So guys, let's go over the insane floodgates of all the tweets. We have so many tweets to go over. Let's do it real quick. So I apologize in advance if I mispronounce people's names. Gutti Carrera over on Twitter saying, what madness? Crypto fell like never before this week. It feels like Black Friday on all my favorite cryptocurrencies. Hoj, Bitcoin, and Ethereum. Excellent. Let's take a look. This guy is a model. This guy has a huge following, 800,000 followers almost. So I'm following him. I recommend you guys follow him. Make sure you show him some love, some hoj action. And let's continue. Afterwards, Brenda Zambrano responded to his uh, tweet saying, I have seen many publications about hoj, but I have no idea what it is and how to buy it. And who is Brenda? So Brenda uh, does movies, TV stuff, a bunch of stuff. She's on IMDb. Check her out. To learn more about what she does almost 850k followers insane and then follows up with a one two mayweather three four mcgregor saying i just got hoj haha <laughs> when do the memes start this is insane guys make sure you guys are following these people pause the video if you need to at any time hop on their handle show them some hoj love joe corona saying no chance i'm missing this i'm in ready for takeoff hoj finance to the moon Insane guys. So who is Joe? Joe is a professional soccer player, professional athlete. Again, 152.6K followers. It's just rapid fire influencer updates. Great to see. Let's continue. And thank you, Joe, for the love. Thank you, everybody, for the Hoj love. Omar Salgado saying, joining the Hoj finance boat. To the moon it is, Hoj. And let's take a look. Omar Salgado, another influencer, a decent following. Let's take a look at the other tweets. Paul Ariola saying, is there room for me on the boat? Count me in. Definitely there's room for you, Paul. All aboard the Hoj train, all aboard the Hoj boat. We're going to go to the moon. We're going to go to Mars. We're going to go to a new dimension. To the moon, he says, Hoj at Hoj Finance. We take a look at Paul, another professional soccer player. Insane. Playing for DC United. So great to see this. Thank you, Paul. Thank you, everybody. 
and it continues, guys. Rubio, Giovanni, Mendez, Ruben. Where are we off to? Moon or Mars? Hoj to the moon at Hoj Finance. Who is Rubio? Another professional athlete. Another professional footballer. Insane, guys. I love this. I love this. And it continues. It just doesn't stop. I don't want it to stop. Another one. Another one. Russell Canoose saying that doesn't sound too bad of an idea at all. Count me in too. Love this project and community. Hoj to the moon at Hoj Finance. And you got Omar also responding. So you know there's a lot of internal conversations going on. Who is Russell? Another professional athlete. Nike athlete. This guy's going in. This guy knows what's good. Amazing stuff, guys. Let's take a look at what Scotty Sire and later words KFC have to say about Hoj. So Scotty Sire saying Hoj isn't a pump and dump. You can see through the wallet distribution, fully docs developers. It exists in the same class as Shiba and Doge. You can check their audits to make sure there is no backdoors in their coding. The information is there. You just have to do the research. So guys, if we see people are still saying Hoj is a scam or this or that, obviously that conversation has been well eradicated for a long time. Show them the right way. Show them the way. Show them a certic audit. Show them the flat wallet distribution. There's many assets and there's many avenues to show people, hey, you know what? I'm going to give this project a chance. And let's talk about KFC. So KFC Barstool saying the DeFi 100 guys are absolute f***ing trash bags. It's this kind of sh that makes the whole crypto world look bad would never and will never happen with my Hoj fam. So thank you, KFC. We all love you, KFC Barstool. We love that your support that you guys have given. And I agree with what KFC has to say here. It's not good to see crypto projects pull out $32 million from innocent investors. Hopefully they get caught. Hopefully, you know, the mask cracks and, you know, something that they left behind, a paper trail. Only time can tell. And I love this Hoj fam. This Hoj cryptocurrency project has a strong foundation and it's just more than a token. It's a culture. It's a movement. It's art. It's memes. It's NFTs. It's it's so much more. And we're going to have unthrottled potential with Ethereum 2.0 right around the corner. Hunnigan, what happened? The transmission got cut off. Hoj, 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 hoj. So guys, I hope you guys enjoyed all those bullish tweets going on from everyone throwing love into Hoj. Let's finish up with the Hoj daily burn. So 87.8 million Hoj was burned from circulation in the last 24 hours. And guys, these numbers are small. And when we get listed on exchanges with fiat and the inevitable goal that is mentioned many times by the core team is to get listed on all those great exchanges. So guys, get in early. I'm not a financial advisor, but get in early. Hoddle that hoj to the moon and beyond. And guys, if you enjoyed this video, remember to smash up the like button. We're almost at 2,000 subscribers, so thank you very much for the support. I really appreciate it. Make sure you guys are subscribed and hit the notification bell, and that way you're alerted of the daily uploads. And I will see you guys in the next video. Have an excellent day.